it's just wonderful that I can come into your family. You said in your speech you were giving her away. That's not the case. I'm coming into your family and forever more will be together. <laughs> I am not the most natural of public speakers, so please bear with me as I get through this very emotional speech on the day I gave away my only daughter. I look around the room and I'm grateful to see how many of you have traveled from far to join us this evening in fact, barring the Antarctica, every continent is represented here this evening. Apparently in these speeches, fathers are supposed to say nice things about their daughters. I have a problem with this. <laughs> and the problem is, how do I condense into 10 minutes how incredible Natasha is? As I look at Natasha, I can't help but reflect on the years I was lucky enough to watch her grow and become a beautiful, dynamic, accomplished, strong, kind, loyal woman she is today. She captured my heart on the day she was born and I became more and more in awe of her as the years passed by. She's my little girl, my princess, and my ray of sunlight. And no matter what her age, she'll always be that to me. Stretch forth your hand from your holy darling place and join together these your servant James and your servant Natasha. Step into the lust of you, James, into the lust of you, Natasha, the storm of the Padros, and to you, and to you, Pneumatus. Despite hitting it off, it took him to EY Office Christmas Party 2050 to ask her out. Wow. But thank God he did, because Natasha is the most generous, loyal, and kind hearted person I know. And for all the joshing, James is interesting, interested, and exceptionally funny. Um, and, you know, 
if you wanted to bring together a group of friends, he's the first person you'd turn to, and that's as great a trait as you could wish for. Wherever James may fall down, Natasha excels. They're one of those rare couples that are stronger together. Sasha, you're such a beautiful person, and I think you look absolutely amazing tonight.